this week on the Hoover Boys. I was just gonna circle around and come back down here because I knew I could smell some more shiny. Where we at, buddy? Oh yeah, little shiny. It's tiny. It's December 28th, 2018. December 28th, it's t-shirt weather. It's like a 60 degrees out here, absolutely beautiful day. We're here with our friends Ron, Steve, and Mark. It's myself, Brad, Bob, and Bill today. And we're at a farm field, and there used to be a plantation here. Well, there's a lot of uh, construction equipment here beside me, but I had to come back to the truck and get my phone, because it was on the charger. I just popped the copper. So let's take a quarter mile hike that way and go see what it is <sighs> well we made it I put it back in here so it wouldn't dry out where is it there it is yeah could be my last one of 2018 what are you big copper hmm I'm not sure. I think we ought to idea, it, but I'm not sure right now. Let me get two hands on this baby. Classic head, maybe? And I'll be right back. Mmm. Oh. I have no idea. I have absolutely no idea. I see nothing to ID it. But it is a big copper. So we are saving some history today, right buddy? Last hunt of 2018. Let's do it. Silver. Silver? I'm getting my two. Well, I'm getting a lock. And I'm also going to get my... Uh, it's your last hunt. You better do something. I'm gonna do something. I got it. <laughs> Good luck, buddy. Right. I'm trying to block this wind, B. It's what windy out here. What, what do you got, got so far, buddy? I can't hear you. What I you got? just have a little piece of shoe buckle frame. Nothing on it. Oh. What do you got, buddy? He's got yeah. something with something yeah. on it. He got some deets? Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> you got a British Wheatie. Is it 1883? Yep. The difference years. between like the bronze coins and the copper coins. 100 years before my birthday. Is it uh, King George IV? Or no, that's. Who is that on there? It's the King of England. Is it a king or a queen? Oh, Looks like a lady. I can't tell. Very cool. Yeah. What do you got going on? Is it the same shoe buckle frame? I don't think so. Mine's thinner and has like yeah. more design lines on it. Cool. Any buttons? No, not a button. Oh, yeah. I, got a yeah, I, got, I got one really? button before this. Yeah. So. New button. I have shot, right. shotgun slugs. Game on. Tom back. Yeah, I think Brad has a little time back. Yeah, Brad's got yeah. a time back. Very good. Nice. All right, let's do it. So, let's do it some more. Where you two are hunting? Probably. Yeah. I was. I was all the way over there. Did you just fart? No. No. <laughs> nice ice cream cone, buddy. Thank you. Oh, Bobby Buttons, what happened? What did you do? I heard it. Just get them bulky gloves on. What's got going on there? I don't know. I definitely can see an eagle of some sort. You think so? I'm pretty sure of it. It could have been. It's pretty schmoozy though. Find, find a bigger one. That's cool. Well, Is that your first button? Deep. Yeah, that's my Is first button. First button on the. Oh. Yeah, it was a very hard signal. This place is pretty, pretty of nice course. looking. Little rolling hills down to a creek. Beautiful rolling hills. I just wish his wind would die down. Yeah, the wind is awful. The wind blows. It does. I came over here to check out Bobby's uh, buffalo nickel he found on the surface. And then I took a couple steps and got an 86 signal. And it's shiny. That's a silver quarter. It's been a long time since I found a silver quarter. What are? I think it's a barber. It's a barber quarter, B. Is it really? It is a barber. 
don't think I've ever found a barber quarter in my life. You found a barber quarter? No. Oh, I dropped it. I had to. Uh, Look at it shining right up. Uh, barber. Barber. What's the date? I don't know. Let me finish cleaning it. I think it's uh, 1898. You want it? Well, I, I wouldn't have found it if you wouldn't have. I wouldn't have found it if you wouldn't have found that buffalo nickel. A bucket list. You found barber quarters. You pulled one out of the beach. Huh? You found a barber quarter before. Yeah. You have. I'm sorry about the wind. It's uh, it's it's awful today. There's there's no way to block it completely. But there we go. Barber quarter. Beautiful eagle. There's no mint. It's Philadelphia. It is a 1898. A little bit of circulation, but that's a good looking coin. Nice big silver, last time of 2018, I like it. Of course we don't have any bets today, which is fine. It's a good looking hoodie, Ron. Huh? It's a good looking hoodie. What do you got going on over here? Oh. Get it. <laughs> See if I can block this one a little better. It's fat. You said it was in the 70s? 77. Pro. On the AT Pro? Oh. Ooh. This has some details. Please don't be a smoothie. Is it chunky or is it details? I can't tell. <laughs> uh, I think it's. I just got a silver. Did you? Mm hmm. Farm field copper definitely. Chewy, but uh, that is Britannia there. And you can see the back of King George's bust. That's the back of George's head, so that's a King George II. Yeah, buddy. A little mid 1700s copper coinage. Doop. <laughs> I should have lied, Doug, this one, but there's nobody around me, unfortunately. I think I got one of those big pennies. Maybe it's a large set, maybe it's a half penny. Maybe it's British, maybe it's U.S. I don't know. But it definitely looks like a big coin. Ew. Let me get two hands on this. I'll be back. <laughs> There's nothing exciting going on in this coin. It's uh, as smooth as Brad's butt. Ron's now saying he might have another copper, so we're going to go over there. I oh, see so you haven't seen it yet. It just sounds good. This is not far from your last one. 8081. Be a shiny one. It's allowed to be shiny, right? So in there? Yeah. You're going after an 18 inch can? <laughs> oh! I said a lot, though, my last one. What was yours? It's smooth. I like your hat. It's a good looking hat, buddy. I was going to say, it sounds like it's this way a little bit. <laughs> He's just meat pulling it. <laughs> Is Brad rubbing on something? <clears throat> Anything? Oh, it's coming out. It's coming out of the ground. Here it is. Uh, this this is all of it actually. <laughs> I thought it was gonna break apart. Uh, it's it's heavy, and uh, it's all yours. Congratulations. Think we can get a date off of that? Second. <laughs> Second. Oh, nice. Isn't that a good looking buckle? It's a fancy D. I think that's pretty early buckle. It is early. We were seeing a bunch of buckles like that in that, that book we were looking at last yeah. night. Like late 16s, yeah. early 1700s. That's pretty. I like it. Yeah. It almost looks like it's white metal too. It's just like green. Some early stuff. I like it. A relic. You can see my fancy buckle? What are we showing? A D buckle. An old one. An oldie. It is a really old one. Hey, check this out. What do you got? This you got some a, stuff? This is a serious, seriously erectified. You got... Oh, holy... <laughs> Hell, that's an early button. Yeah, it's totally hand done. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
You see the cat so, uh, cast seam? You, yeah, you know, rectified in your life. It's so fat. Yeah, here's the it's, other thing I found way out there. So unbelievably fat. No idea. Is that a jet or something? Maybe it's possible. Some sort. Of it's got two little dots thing. on the on the back side. Huh? It's an early sight. Yeah. A jet and turned into a wizard. Congratulations. A jet. I can't say that. A jet and you can't say jet and. I like my D better. Yeah. <laughs> That's what she said. I was just gonna circle around and come back down here because I knew I could smell some more shiny. I'm gonna find all kind of little bits and pieces here and there. Where we at, buddy? Oh yeah, little shiny. It's tiny. That's a trime, dude. Is it a trime? Yeah, I can yeah. see the C. That's, it. That's awesome. <laughs> Let's try to pop this dirt. Yep, yep there's a star. Yep. <laughs> nice. Nice. Things be in pretty decent condition. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's yeah. really sharp. Really, I'm getting misted. <laughs> hey, let's finish cleaning it up. I'll come back into the close up, dude. That's awesome. <laughs> Trime time in the middle of the field. We're definitely on an old home site because a bunch of iron in here and a bunch of broken like furniture pieces and stuff. 1852 second year trime. That thing is beautiful, man. Let me try to zoom back out here for a second. Uh, gotta zoom in to get them little tiny coins. Trime time. <laughs> Bulk. <laughs> Congrats, dude. I'm high town it over to Bill. Apparently, he has shiny now. Shiny decided to come to the party today. That's not far from where the barber quarter came from. Yeah, I don't think it's as long as your barber, but it's, nice. it's still a smirk. You got Markness? Yeah, I got Markness. You plug it? Yeah, you sure it's a Merc? Yeah, I guess. Yeah, it is a Merc, okay. You gonna fill it or are you just gonna let me yeah, just finger? Rub on it, man. You want me to rub it? You know, you uh, really mean it though, you know? Well, what if, what if it's a, a 16D or something? Yeah, it's gonna be sold, it's gonna stay in my collection. I'll, I'll lightly touch it then. I can't tell. I'm gonna fill it up off camera then. I'm not rubbing a Merc. <laughs> <Why not? laughs> that, that, that's no, stuff that Brad would do. Yeah, well, Brad would rub a Merc. Uh, we just rubbed the 1960s. <laughs> <laughs> that's funny. I don't care. That's why you don't rub your silver coins. It's a 1916. First year Merc and no D. No D. So it's not a rare and valuable one, but oh, it's still awesome. But you don't you don't rub silver until you know what they are. That's beautiful. Beautiful little Mercury dime. No, oh, I'm sorry, a winged liberty. I don't know what the coin collector got to yell at me again. <laughs> Where's everybody else? I don't know, they're all spreading out now. Oh, this is like the area. This is the area. I know. Huh? Oh well. This sounds like one of those silvers on edge. It's got the little like close to the surface double tappy. Be a shiny. That'd be cool to get three shinies in a row. I'm sorry, I'm talking to Ron. He's over that way. I just want to get it on my perm to figure out what's going on. Okay, I dug in the right spot. It's kind of hard when they're in there. On edge like that. It's so pure. Oh, oh. that's the copper. <laughs> oh, nice. Way to go, buddy. Thanks, pal. <laughs> it was definitely on edge. You hear whip, 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 whip. Have some details. Oh no, it's drying so fast. Get my chopstick out. <laughs> I don't know. We'll be back. Hopefully, I can ID it. It's uh, pretty toasty. When I was cleaning it up, I could make out the outline of a drape bust. You can almost see it on the reverse. A little bit of the one cent in the uh, older style wreath. It was a drape bust, large cent at some point in time. Nice early copper coin. It's hard to see Liberty, but I saw her on there, so I'm gonna give her a kissy for good luck. We got pizzas coming. Woo! <laughs> I'm hungover. Pizza's gonna be delicious. 
Yeah, I'm filming. You got a little coin, I want to see it. King George to the second degree, huh? That's the second King George out of there. At least you got some ID on yours. Mine are not very identifiable. You could you could probably take some sandpaper and oh. get all that grit off of there and this is make it pretty again. Like Ugh, that's too close. Let's see how pitted it was. Breastplate stuff. It looks like saddle yeah, strap, saddle guide. strap guide. guide. Same thing with this thingy. This is definitely some sort of old hammered. That could have been an old hammered coin. 15th century. It feels coin, different. Coin. It's got differentness to it. You got all kinds of stuff. Because it's an old serious coin. The shoe buckle frame. Some serious shoe buckle frame. Was everything serious today with you? Very. This is the buffalo That's nickel. The buffalo surface. Buffalo. Yeah, I came over to look at this and I tripped over that barber quarter. Another unidentifiable another little chunk of something. Yeah. That really looks like a piece of a wing. We're gonna eat some food and probably go back over there, huh? Uh, you're 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 stretching it now. I'm not. That's the shoulder of a wing. <laughs> you are stretching it. That's rev war. I always appreciate it, but you That's are stretching. That's rev war. There's no stretching. You, you, that. you still pulling stuff out of there? You got a little button? Are you gonna call this a coin? That's, a shank, that that, coin, that's a shank that mark. A shank. Yeah. <laughs> All right, I'm done looking at your your muskety balls. balls. All right, that's enough balls. I just ate way, way too much pizza. But it was meat lovers. I mean, who can blame me? I think we're gonna have a Brad sighting. He's calling me over. You got the foo out? Yeah. This is. I mean, you know, just in case. See the shiny on it? See the flower? See the button? That's a silver button. Yeah. Cup link, maybe? There's two to rose. So. That's an. Ah, oh man, that is wild. Isn't that cool? That is cool. There, look at that little shanker. I think it's a button. It's a cup link. No, yeah, I think it's a button. That's yeah, probably a cup link. Yeah, I got a button, Bob. Dude, nice. Nice button, right? You got a silver cup link. It's silver. Yeah. Cool not, little. Not gonna commit, are you? Cool little oh, flower on there. A silver button. Yes, sir. Nice cup link. Hey, dude. thanks, man. <laughs> <laughs> Either way, it's amazing. Okay. It's awesome. <laughs> Now, find the other the other part of the cup link was gold. It was a two tone. Huh? I want yeah, Tom back. Tom know. back. I'll have like you know. Oh, I'd bottom feed huh? that. Yeah. What are you scraping on? Sword belt plate. What is that? A chunk of sword belt plate. Sword belt, belt buckle. That is some weird wild stuff right there, Bobby. More chewed up, but I did find it. It's beautiful, whatever it is. <laughs> I just got another nice chunk of shoe buckle frame too. Yeah. That is a nice chunk of shoe buckle frame. It's an early sight. We don't have a whole lot of time left. The sun's getting getting closer and closer. Don't say it. Alright, well, see you later. Corner button? Corner button. Hold on, buddy. Let me get over here. Be a big old fat copper with some identification. Is it beeping good? Oh, yes. That's a copper, buddy. Yeah. Let me get it in the sun. You gonna have an ID, Mr. Copper? Or Mrs. Copper? Someone that's not left handed. Try to clean that off. Well, this is my left hand. <laughs> hmm. Anything? You wanna play with it for him? Let's all touch it. <laughs> get our mitts on it. Oh, yeah. It is. Any ID? Anything? I'm gonna see something. Like, oh man, these are all so close. They're so close to almost being identified. Oh, it's like such a rush. Like, oh, I got a 1700s coin, and it's like, well, it's a 1700s round thing. Another one of these. Fine. The, what's the the numbers? 8283. 8283. Right. Thank you. Big copper. I almost feel like that's the bottom of the bus right there. Hmm. No, it's a. That's King George II. second. Yeah. It's a high beaten KG2 if it is. It looks like bust. I don't know. I can't be confirmed, buddy. Oh, but it's a coin. What else you got in here? You got a 1916. Mark, you got a bunch of buttons. I don't even have that many buttons, I don't think. I don't know what the heck that thing is. Probably off saddle stuff, yeah. 
big dandy. Hmm, good stuff. Another. Anything to report, baby? Shoe buckle frame. Shoe buckle frame Well, GL and HH. You again? Yeah, the stock clothes getting ridiculous today. Dude, I'm getting stupid depth Seriously, too. Absolutely oh, there we go. It was like right on the top of my plug, like right here, and then bonk. It's a different size. Yeah, I know. Right? Virginia half penny size, maybe? That'd be neatness. Uh oh. What is it? Hmm. Mm. Anything? Other side? Anything? <laughs> yeah. Tough, tough feel. Good. At least there's silvers coming out of here. We got some detail on those. <laughs> the coppers have been wasted. Hmm, that blow always helps. Well, good luck with your identification, buddy. That's an NPI. Hey, you said all you want to do is pop a copper. That's it. You got one. Can I get one? Yeah, I'll hit that. Brad was just talking about how he's just getting ridiculous depth. I just wanted to show how deep this was because it's, it's ridiculous. Big old spoon bowl, right? I just pulled that out of down in there. And oh, I still got my probe on. But it's two probes deep. I would not make this up. That's ridiculous. <laughs> Alright. Saving deep history. Low ground bounce. This thing gets deep. No! No! <laughs> you gonna watch Bill? 1787 half real. <laughs> He's going right deep. <laughs> it's I'm pure. High, high 70s. Oh, uh, you sunk right back up. Yeah. Ribbit. No. <laughs> Ribbit. Oh, it's right on the surface. Is that it? That is not it. That is it. That? That's it. This? Yes, that's it. It's silver. Is that a little piece of silver? It looks like it. Like melted silver? It certainly beeped like silver. It's going to get the acid, I'll tell you that. I'm rubbing it hard. <laughs> Please do. Hmm. Tell you what, I'll turn it into silver. <laughs> it does almost look like silver. That was beeping tiny. I mean, that makes sense. You know, that's not a minuscule. Well, you, they melted your half real down into a little mm -hmm. silver blob. That was fruit of them. What are you doing, colonial people? Uh, that is silver. It, it's, it's too heavy. It's, it's heavy. It's too heavy to be aluminum. Yep, it's silver. Silver plated lead, nice. So I was just walking this line right here, and I looked up at Bill and said, Oh, I want one more coin signal. <laughs> that's pure. Be a coin. You let be shiny. Anything? Oh, it's What's a Pepper 83. 83? It is now. That was like a right around 80. You got in here? I got the D, you know? Oh, wow. No, yeah, it might be like old spectacle or something. That's what I said. It's huge. That's different. That's some early stuff, man. I was thinking, you know, when people were. I pulled like the barber and we got the other 1800s coins. I was hoping someone's gonna find an Indian here, but this place is way older in Indian range. If there was an Indian, it would have been random. That's cool. I just wanted a coin signal, it didn't need to be a coin. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Smiley, ninth inning. <laughs> Did you? What the? Yeah. Is that oh, is that the impression? Yeah. <laughs> I thought that was a coin. I don't know what in the world. Yeah. What in the world is right. <laughs> can, I, can I hold it? Yeah. Hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> What's it beep on the knocks? 20? 19? 1920. What does that mean? Coin. Coin? <laughs> and congrats. Thank you. Is that your first copper of the day? Take it. Second. Yeah, the half penny. Oh, yeah, the, the newer one. <laughs> the Vicky. Apparently, Bob just got one too, but he's not calling me over for some reason. I think he's still sore about that Bob recorder that was almost in his line. That was funny. <laughs> <laughs> uh, right, right.
Oh, is, is the light on? <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Well, fellas, we made a ton of memories 2018. Memories? Memories. Oh, memories. Made some more memories today. Look at this. Woo! Full board. A lot of relics. There's some of the trash and batteries and losing scratch off tickets. Uh, I don't know which way to go. I'll start with me. Anybody want to come over here and help? You're welcome to. Spoon bowls and old buckles. and There's my buttons. A couple little fancy ones. I wish the coppers came out of the ground like this weedy. But they didn't. The bar recorder. 1898. Here's this little buckle. I pulled out the, the buckles book. There it is right there. An age. It's early. 15 to 1650. Yeah. This, uh, Steve, some drawer pulls, some buttons, little cuff links, harmonica reed, the copper. <laughs> Why didn't it come out like this? <laughs> the 1883 half penny. Queen Vicky. Bobby. I don't know what that thing is, but it's very ornate. You don't know what? This thing. I'm still going with, uh, <laughs> shoulder plate. Fancy sword. Bunch of little. Sh Shoe buckle frames, broken pieces, and saddle strap guides, and what's this uh, eight hole thing, Bobby? What are you calling that? Eight hole button? <laughs> Buffalo nickel, white copper. King George II. That one's lost with some meat on the bone. Who's this? This is Brad. He got a big old spoon bowl. Bunch of Tom backs. Little. It was not the cast lead. <laughs> I don't know what this is, some little tokeny thing. March 20 something. There's his little silver cuff link, and I don't think we got an idea on that copy. You got a couple Wheaties today, Brad? Yeah. No Indians? This is Mark. We got some saddle pieces, a bit boss, bunch of buttons, a D. He got on a white copper. The coppers were tough in that field. Who's next? Ron? It's a shoe buckle framage, D buckles, saddle piece, a lot of saddle pieces. You got an ox knob, that's cool. Some buttons. You got the King George II and the Trime. Any day a Trime comes out of the ground, it's a good day. That's a clean one, too. And Billy. Billy had a great little day with some buttons. He got a knee buckle we didn't get on film. I don't know what you guys are doing behind me, but somebody's going to get horse kicked. Uh, <laughs> shoe buckle frame. He got a King George II. I don't know, oh, that's a button. And you get the Merc Dime, 16. Can we try to throw coins at my to crack? Do a, I was trying to do a kip out. I just did a kip out. What's he doing? What is he doing? He, we're trying to do a kip out. That was all that noise. He's young again. Huh? Oh, oh no! What? Again. <laughs> Again. <laughs> Until next week or next year, help clean up the ground, dig it all, and take your trash with you. Why? Because all holes matter. <laughs>
fat. This <laughs> is a fat jag. That's a nice hit. Yeah, cool sight, man. There's a high turn right there. Should we go right into a live dig? Okay. You're gonna finger, finger bang your button. Come on, show something. Cannon. Cannon. <laughs> Not today.